Hello, everyone. So we talked about warm-ups and how they are a great way to start your class. Now, if you have older kids, you can use something called mind warmers. So let's see some of the really good mind warmers. Number one, tongue twisters. How much wood would a woodchuck chuck if a woodchuck could chuck wood? But you introduce it slowly and then you speed it up later. Number two, riddles. What has to be broken so you can use it? Hmm. And you can lead them in the right direction. Wow, the answer is an egg. Number three, the game of opposites. So here you give them a word and they need to tell you a word with the opposite meaning. For example, big, they need to say small. Fast, they need to say slow. And if they're more advanced, you can use more complicated words. Number four, synonyms. So this is similar to the previous one, but here you want the students to give you a word with the same or similar meaning. So you, said, you tell them beautiful, and you can offer them options, pretty, ugly. Which one is it? Pretty, very good. And number five is a game of what is it? So here they can play detectives and you give them some clues. So you can say, it's round. We use it to play different games. It's a ball. Very good. And you can even use pictures and reveal the whole picture when they guess the word.